Azure Virtual Desktop, Windows 365, Remote Apps, and Azure DevBox all have something in common. And you can connect to them through an app or a web portal. And if you use all these services, that's 16 clients, which are too many clients for your admins to manage, too many clients for your users to keep straight, and really too many different feature sets between them all, which can even make consultants confused. So let's fix that. The new Windows app is your gateway to securely connect you to all of your Windows devices on all form factors desktops, laptops, tablets, smartphones, and web browsers. And the Windows app is available today on Windows, Mac OS, iOS, iPad OS, and web browsers with Android coming soon. And if you use multiple accounts, you can even switch between them with just a single click. And you can even provide app feedback right here. So any of you who want that native Linux client, which would also integrate very nicely with all of those thin client solutions, now's your chance to make your voice heard. Now don't worry because all of these 16 other clients aren't disappearing tomorrow, so you do have some time to do your transitions. But all of the new development and innovation is going into the new Windows app moving forward. Now one of those things that's made all of these different clients so difficult to manage is the different supported levels for all of the features. Like how in AVD, Teams Media Optimization is only supported for Windows and Mac. But on the Windows app, everybody gets multi-monitor support, custom display resolutions, dynamic display resolutions and scaling, and device redirection for your webcams, audio, storage devices and printers, and a whole lot more. But of course, not everything is 100% the same on every OS for the Windows app either. And that's because you're limited by the OS that you're running on. And these docs here are all linked in the video description below so you can review them. And of course, app security is just what you'd expect with MFA for the user front end and conditional access support on the back end. Now, if you've got AVD, Windows 365 and DevBox, here is these large tiles. And if you've got remote apps, those will be pinned down here at the bottom. You just click to connect to any of the solutions that you want to access. And yes, you can access them all at once if you want to. Now, the new Windows app is in preview today and GA will be coming soon. And I can't really be more specific in the comments because that would be telling. And of course, there's more to come about the new Windows app and the future of VDI solutions and you can click right over here and check out the latest in the VDI space. And as always, happy learning.